Millie's concern about the impending birth has led Sue to book her a specialist to try and conquer her fears. It's not been an easy pregnancy. I was rushed to hospital because the baby has a high heart rate. I'm really worried something's going to go wrong or I'm going to end up in an emergency C-section. If you hold on to that fear, that's going to come in through to your labour. It's important for Millie to be as calm as possible during the birth to avoid stressing the baby. So, do you know about the muscles of the uterus or anything like that? Not really, Not no. Really. So Kerry teaches hypnobirthing to help pregnant women stay calm during difficult births. This is the cervix, this is the baby's head. So, as the contractions build, as they push, the cervix is getting shorter. And the baby's head's going to come out all on its own. And your baby's born. <laughs> that just reminded me of the ring of fire. I was just going to say the ring of fire. For a fire. little bit. I've given birth twice before. It's definitely one of the hardest things a woman can do. I'm prepared to try anything to make this birth easier. We want you completely, completely, completely relaxed. So I'm just going to put the music on. You get yourself relaxed there, Millie. <laughs> This is a guided relaxation for you to enjoy. Let your buttocks sink into the surface beneath you. The hypnobirthing was interesting. It's definitely not something that I've ever tried, but I just really wanted to try and get Millie to relax. And we did definitely relax because I nearly fell asleep in it and Millie definitely very nearly fell asleep as well. Exhale any tension you may feel in your jaw, your neck and your shoulders. Seeing Millie more relaxed is really great. I'm just hoping that everything is going to be OK. Slowly become aware of your surroundings. We you open your eyes, feeling refreshed and relaxed. How are you feeling? You didn't fall asleep, that's a good one. So you need to do that every day and just relax and, and switch off. I'm really, really hoping that it's helped Millie relax and be a lot more confident and just help her kind of deal with anything that might arise in labour. Millie has just over a week to practice before the birth. <laughs>